are still working to seat a jury in the trial of George Zimmerman, accused of murdering Trayvon Martin. Tonight, why it's been so difficult and the one man who said, pick me, until they learn more about him. ABC's Matt Gutman on this case from the start. Tonight, mounting concern of jurors harboring hidden agendas, stealing their way onto the George Zimmerman trial. What we call a stealth juror is unbelievably dangerous, not only to the case, but it's really devastating to the system. Known as E7, one juror presented himself as the ideal juror, telling the court he'd barely even heard of Trayvon Martin. So certainly you've never been on one no. of those websites or no. posted a comment or part participated in a discussion? No. Moments later on Wednesday, a note carried into Judge Deborah Nelson. I don't need an explanation for what's posted. I just want to know if that is in fact your posting. Yes. He was apparently an activist posting online rants against Zimmerman. That juror already dismissed along with 150 others, but the haggling over the jurors is set to continue this week. And there may be something else driving stealth jurors, excitement. This is a very high profile trial. Who wouldn't want to sit on it? You know, so we've got people that, that would love to be able to be that juror, to be able to be right in the middle of all the limelight. They've never had it before. So how do you sniff out a stealth juror? Experts tell us if a potential juror seems to give the perfect answer or is too eager to spend weeks sequestered during a trial, David, they are probably suspect.